Hello everyone. I welcome you all to ATM Creations. Let's begin with today's challenge. The angles are marked at every 60 degrees. And let me tell you the radius of these circles. The first one is 2. This is 5.6. And this is 10. Then in the outermost circle, in every grid, I roughly mark the center. To draw this outermost layer curve, I kept the protractor like this. From this intersection to the point we marked. And then I drew the curve. For inner layer, it is freehand. I think you can make it out so easily because the outer layer curve is so perfect and the inner layer is not so perfect. And these two curves are absolutely freehand. No measurements. Let's begin painting. So in the previous challenge video, I did discuss about how I developed my maturity that I'm I'm not questioning God why did the, why did you make this happen or why did you not make this happen I don't question God at all that's what I was saying now I would like to share two three of such instances where something that I did not expect happened and I still did not question God The one such instance is this. Most of you who know me also know that I am Alamka Book of Records uh, title holder for world's big mandala art as a solo attempt for 625 square feet. Of course, after finishing Alamka, my I mean my next goal was to get into Guinness Book of Records. For applying only, it was one big of an issue because I didn't know what should I write for a proper application. And I tried uh, in three different ways. All three failed. Fourth attempt, yes, I succeeded in getting my application approved. I was so happy. And the application was approved by 2023 January. Okay and I bought all the materials and I even started my attempt because it, I had a long way to finish it and in between I lost my dad so I was grieving for quite a long than expected and um, then other priorities took over and from this January it was uh, the online courses I couldn't uh, focus on Continuing Guinness attempt. And uh, at one point of time, I, I don't know what happened on one morning when I woke up. I think it was a Saturday or Sunday, but definitely a weekend. Because Sriram was also there at home. It was a no alarm morning okay so when i woke up i somehow felt like uh, opening my account with the uh, guinness record website i don't know why i felt like that i when when i opened the status of my application earlier it used to be evidence pending and that day when i opened the uh, account at uh, guinness record website it says your application expired i said my application expired because I did not submit evidence on time because there was no target time actually. You can complete whenever you want. But just that before you have completed, if someone else had broken the same record, then your target will change. So 
सो नॉर्मली गिनेस रिकॉर्ड विल नॉट से अप्लीकेशन एक्सपायर्ड इन दैट केस इट विल ओनली से टारगेट टू एंटर इन टू गिनेस रिकॉर्ड इज चेंज दैट इज वॉट शुड बी दि स्टेटस बट इन स्टेट माई एप्लीकेशन वॉज इट्स इज एक्सपायर्ड एंड आई डोंट पैनिक but i was definitely wanting to know why application expired you know i was supposed to create 5000 small mandalas following all the rules kinas laid out and i was agreeing to all those rules so the target for me to get into guinness record was creating 5000 small mandalas following all the rules they had given i'm not going to discuss about what are those rules but yeah there were some rules and uh, now what i found out was someone had already broken that record with 8282 mandalas created okay someone from india the one who made the record was from country syria the one who had broken the record is from india haryana and now when i wrote to guinness book of records asking why my application has expired they said uh, dear applicant your uh, target has changed from 5000 mandalas to 10000 mandalas just stop it would you like to reactivate your application we have no problem in reactivating your application but would you like to reactivate now the new target is going to be 10000 i replied asking can i take couple of day di- couple of days time to respond they said yes and i took couple of days not to assess the amount of materials that i would require but definitely to assess the amount of time i would need to complete because now my priorities have actually changed i have loads of videos to be created for my recorded courses people trust me and have joined my courses and i have not completed delivering the promised videos so which means i need to do that on priority so when i calculated the amount of time required to complete it was way more than what i can afford so i decided not to reactivate my application so i wrote back to them saying thank you so much for explaining why my application has expired and yes thank you for your um timely response whenever i sent you a query and i am not reactivating my application so though i have responded to guinness saying i am not reactivating the application one corner of my heart felt broken because i really wanted to do it as a matter of personal achieve and uh, yeah i was little depressed actually i was um, i shouldn't say depressed i was sad and unhappy about uh, um that i couldn't make it to Guinness Book of Records, and I was quiet. You know, um, what I do is, if at all I'm going through tough time, or if I'm going through something unpleasant, okay, what I do is I generally keep quiet. I don't talk to people, and uh, 
my contacts and my friends they find it absolutely normal if i am a non stop chatterbox but if i'm quiet they find it extremely abnormal so when i was quiet after conveying to guinness books that do not activate my application again i was quiet obviously so my friends asked me radha what happened why are you so quiet and uh, i don't open up to all of them but to three of them yes i did open up and then i told what had happened and why am i quiet among those three one suggested radha why don't you submit a new application i said for what so one of my friends suggested a title and that title is a secret huh because i still do not know the result suggested a title and said uh, why don't you submit a new application i said that's possible and then he was like come let's join in a zoom meet and i want to see you submitting the application now i said and immediately my mood totally changed from being sad or unhappy to complete excitement i submitted new application and i am awaiting to hear from guinness books any time before 31st of december so another maybe one more month of wait if they don't approve i'll submit another application okay now the point is maybe god knew better that the earlier application is extremely time taking and this girl cannot afford doing it so someone else was graced by god to break that record and they finished it so if i wear um my older version no i would have question god oh god i bought this material that material uh, why did you not uh, help me do it i would have posed at least 100 questions to god on why my application got expired and why someone else could do it and i could not do it i would have asked a lot of questions um poor god now this is a new version of radha no having gone through all the troubles all the struggles i shouldn't say troubles struggles so i did not question god this time i only believe i completely believe as i told you in the previous challenge video also in spite of your best efforts if things don't go your way it only means things are happening according to god's way trust me god's way would be much better than your way always always and then for my limca book of records also i was trying for varieties of venues party halls wedding halls we all would have seen the uh, 
places where they put up a board like this many square feet available for office space you know i didn't leave even those kind of uh, places to explore to complete my limca books none of them worked i was at the verge of giving up and that is when i thought i'll approach uh, kid school and i'm talking about may 2021 when covid second wave was at its peak so nobody was willing to give their place a lot of places were available but in fearing covid nobody gave when i was at the verge of giving up then the idea of approaching kid school came up to me so when i approached they welcomed me with open arms so that's how it was and every time in spite of my best effort in spite of my best explanations when people said no for giving their place i was willing to pay anything that they ask and i even tried convincing those place owners by saying that i will pay premium cost if you want but nobody was willing to even accept the premium cost for the fear of covid and when my kid school started supporting my attempt that is when i understood why god rejected the other places rooted me towards the school in no other places i would have received the support as i received in school and all these what kind of support i received from school is all explained in um june challenge videos so if you want you can go ahead and watch uh, all the videos in playlist dot mandala challenge if you do not know dot mandala also you can just play the video close your eyes and listen because loads of messages is what i have shared in each and every video so the point is i would like to repeat again and again because um when most of the people uh, talk to me they say that i i put in my best efforts radha it still did not happen okay fine it only means not happening was good for you in what way it is good maybe sometimes you will understand immediately sometimes you'll understand later but believe that is only good for you Now go ahead and share similar incidences from your life in the comment section of the video. I would definitely love to read each and every one of them and respond to your comments as well. Mandala for this challenge is done. Now go ahead, recreate it, share it with me.